Okay, uh, Dan Fitzpatrick here, stockmarketmentor.com. And uh, no, I'm not going to be trading Bitcoin here, but I do want to look at the, I do want to look at the chart here. Um, and the reason is I'm going to be going into what I call IBIT, uh, the iShares Bitcoin Trust, IBIT. But first, let's look at the underlying here. Um, so this has been in this, in this downtrend. It's been kind of a significant downtrend here with the, um, I think this is the 100 day moving average defining resistance. Okay, well, just today, this thing broke through. A 50 day moving average is now starting to pull upwards again because of these strong moves here. And so I'm looking at this right now as this is a key break. Now, this is the 200 day moving average. And so you can see where this is really where the resistance is right here. So I think if we're just going to look at that, uh, we've got about 69,000, uh, which would be resistance. I'd say, you know, about a thousand, a uh, thousand bucks um, from, from where it is right now, uh, something like that, right around there. Uh, because each day that goes by, this moves down just a little bit more. So that's really a level that I would look at as, as um, some kind of technical resistance. But because of what's happening in the Bitcoin market now with having coming up and, and all these other things, I'm not sitting here pounding the table uh, like I'm a big Bitcoin bull, though I, I, at full disclosure, I am. I, I bought uh, a bunch more even today. I feel like I got, I missed by a few days, but I had to move money around to take advantage of it and all that jazz. So whatever, don't cry for me, Argentina. Um, but I look at this and I think it's going a lot higher. My bet is that by tomorrow, the way this is going, I think you're going to wind up seeing a test of this 200 day moving average. But that leads me to this because I, you know, I really just like to talk about um, stocks here. So if we look at this, okay. I drew this uh, anchored volume weighted average price indicator from the low here, from this last low, all the way up here. It's not been a day where it's been negative. Um, so yesterday, this came down, almost touched the anchored volume weighted average price. So based by the way, on, on all the shares that have traded since this low, the average price is right, right about here. So it tested that general area and rallied higher. Today, this actually came down, started a little bit lower, just slightly lower than yesterday's intraday low. Um, but you can see it's had a heck of a move, put a heck of a move, almost 7% up from where it opened. So I look at this and I see something that's going higher. And if I'm correct about Bitcoin, I think I'm also going to be correct about this. And I can really see this thing. Um, you know, I can see it will do it this way. I can see this thing coming to a new high. Uh, actually, very soon, uh, very soon. So my suggestion is if you're not long, I don't think it's too late for you to get long this. You're going to have to give it about 9% um, room to pull back again. But ultimately, just because of what's happening in the crypto market, particularly with Bitcoin, this is something where you want to hop on that train. You don't need a wallet for this. You could just buy the stock. It's essentially the same thing as buying the Bitcoin. And I know some of you anal retentive types are going to go, no, it's not. It's not quite the same because they charge you a fee. And I get that. It's the same as Bitcoin. Okay. That's the way I'll look at it. And that's all I got for you members. Uh, good strategy session today. I just finished it. I can tell you it's an awesome one because I did it. Um, and uh, Scott McGregor is also crushing it on Crypto Market Mentor. He had a great training session this morning. I always make sure to attend those because I always, why else do you think I'm buying Bitcoin today? And I've already, I already own a slug of it. Uh, but I always learn a lot from Scott. So if you haven't tried out Crypto Market Mentor, I can promise you this, the trial, I think it's 40, 14 days for seven bucks. If you're not making gobs of money during that 14 days, then you're right to cancel. 
uh, even ask for your seven bucks back. How's that? There's, there's your no risk trade. So, all right, that's all I got for you. I will see you guys next time.